style shoes. My sissy. My sissy smell like salami. <laughs> I smell like salami. Well, you. Guys going well, you. That was a blueberry. <laughs> so we're doing a style shoot today. Oh, I thought you scrunched this. Is. The purpose of a style shoot mostly, firstly, is to get content that you want. So like, ideally, to set up a wedding and the type, how do I explain this? That you want to get, attract more of those types like of weddings. Portfolio yeah, stuff. Yeah, portfolio you want to stuff. Another thing I think, especially when you're starting out, is the connection. So, like, you have to work with a bunch of vendors. <laughs> These years. You have to work with a bunch of vendors to pull this off. So, especially venues, I do think it's good to do it at a venue because then you've got that connection. Usually you'll get on their vendor list. Yeah. So, the more you can do at the start, the better. Oops, I nearly just lost my balance. <laughs> so, Eddie, Eddie came these too. Sick. 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 Oh, it's there. Okay. Let's go get the sushi platter now. Oh. Alright, right, let's go. So I'll shoot. Let's get it. You pay when you leave. You've only paid for like 45 minutes. Fine. Sorry. <laughs> you're filming a YouTube video, but you also want to film my stuff because you're actually just my assistant today. You know you've made it. You know, you know you've made it when Chris Turner is your assistant. <laughs> what do you want? Christmas or lemon tea? Take one. So how much did you pay for this style shoot? Sixty dollars for the sushi. Uh, Sixteen dollars for the snacks, fifteen dollars for parking, what car shirt. Um, so people don't usually sushi. <laughs> okay, that's right. People don't usually pay. No, some people do. I think if you really want a certain vendor, but like generally, you all do it for free. I have paid for models in the past, but I kind of only want to use real couples now because like my style's very relaxed and natural. So I want it to be reflective of that in a, like in a normal couple, like models know how to pose, mm. you know what I mean? But with a couple, like I want to actually use my skills of making them feel relaxed and comfortable. Otherwise, like, I don't know, your portfolio is just going to look like a, a look look. <laughs> so in short, you don't need her. Chris, corporate wants to do weddings, but yeah. they haven't before. And so that's how Kasha had the idea that if we collaborate with them, the benefit is they get all these photos of like a wedding there. Um, Kasha and I obviously want portfolio. Like, you know, everyone who's doing it is kind of getting mostly portfolio work out of it. Oh, Kim! I love Kim. Bless. How are you? Good morning. Oh, Kasha's inside. I'm going to get you Okay, nice. Well, how are you good. going? Have you always been this handsome? <laughs> just, just wake up like this every day. Hello. 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 This is Rebecca Hi. and Chris. Hi. Yeah. Lovely to meet you. How are you going? We've got photo and video as well. Where are we really nice. thinking we'll set up this? Um, we are doing an urban city reception style shoot. So we're at an epic restaurant in town with their own bar across the road. Um, and we're, we've got a couple who are going to play dress ups in beautiful bridal outfits. And we're just going to have fun. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> so we have Culprit the venue. Yeah, we've got Culprit, which is a restaurant. Kasha for photography, Rebecca for photography. Yeah. Yep. We've um, got Christopher uh, Chris for, Turner for video. Video behind the scenes, yep. extraordinaire. We have Rachel Mackwood for makeup. Oh, do you? Yeah. I already told you this three times. Um, <laughs> I love Rachel. Keep that in. Um, we have Hera Couture for bridal, 
and Crane Brothers for the suiting and the shoes. Yeah. We have Chaos and Harmony for the bridal shoes. Yeah. For florals, we have Poppy and April, good friend Tessa. And for stationery, we've got Timberwink. <laughs> this is why I haven't. This is why. This is why I haven't done a styled shoot because it seems like so much shit to organise. It is. It is. This place is pretty sick, though. Yeah. yeah. Oh, it's open. There's a coffee shop just out there if you want to get coffee. Pretty cool place, eh? Yeah. That one's fine. Um, yeah. And then I've got a really nice sensor. Um, it's a light slip dress. Yeah. One of them. place is pretty sick. Honestly, as far as the wedding venue goes, these guys are just starting to do them. And uh, it's pretty insane. You give them all lots of stuff. Yeah, Alex came in. I saw you with some posts where you had a minty up there. Yeah. We did remove. Sweet. All right, I will have uh, room to knock that minty out. Oh, thank you. That looks beautiful. Yeah. But Chris, can you do me a favour? Because we're in a mentoring session. Um, I just feel like... Am I getting paid? No. Yes, your ad revenue, you've already said. Yeah. <laughs> that light's really nice. He's <laughs> doing this with all the wraparound as well. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
Yeah, don't get too close to those candles. You look amazing. Yeah. Preston, I can't see you. Are we having here or do we want to record? I would do it. Yeah. Okay. What would you have? Yeah. Okay. Well, I'm going to So, um, <laughs> the thing is, we have a styled shoot video, but it doesn't make sense for YouTube, so you need to say why you guys did a styled shoot. Oh, what do you mean? <laughs> why is this our problem? It's YouTube's problem. <laughs> what did you think of the styled shoot? Do you think? I think it went really well. Yeah. Yeah. It was I... fun. It was smooth. Mm -hmm. I feel I... like we got some good shots. Do you think it was shots? worth the effort? I think yes. it was worth the effort. <laughs> yes. Even if the images uh, don't uh, get me client bookings, like I'm hoping that they mm. do for both of us, building the relationships with the different vendors, 100% worth it. Yeah. yeah. Content also gets you booking. So the so. more you shoot, the more you book, in my opinion, yeah. whether that's shoots you've organized yourself or you're getting paid for. Yeah. And you haven't sent photos to the vendors yet right no we're waiting, we're waiting for this for video. video yeah right and then we'll mm. send it so it hinges on me basically yeah yes. much. <laughs> yeah 
Makes sense. Anyway, Ooh. shout out Chris Turner. <laughs> Thanks for the video. Yeah, um, <laughs> look at Drew. He's, he's it, giving he's up. Giving up. <laughs> <laughs> That's how Chris feels. That's how I feel. <laughs> I will say that it's with the style shoot, and uh, it's been my experience on previous ones, is that we set up, um, that always goes fine, but then we think we've got all the time in the world to mm -hmm. shoot, and so we take our time yeah. too much <laughs> to start with, and then it always ends up being a mad dash at the end. Okay. okay. Well, I need well, to do a style shoot. Okay, right? yeah. Where do I start? You start with um, a mood board concept mm -hmm. about board. like what you would like the shoot to <coughs> feel like, look like, mm -hmm. and then look at the vibe of it and try and fit vendors in that kind of match yeah. that style. So and then uh, how do you reach out to people? Well, go, quickly going back, um, the mood board is how you reach out to people. Mm. So you, you're selling your creative vision to the other vendors using some sort of mood board or information pack that you've created for them. Um, we are, as creatives, visual people, so mm -hmm. it helps to actually show with inspo pics how it all comes together and like what the idea is in your head. Yeah. In terms of reaching out to people, number one tip, do not Instagram DM unless you know them. Mm -hmm. Like email them, it's a sign of respect. Don't just ask for free stuff through Instagram. Um, and make it clear what they'll get out of it. Yes. So you're not just asking. They'll get out of it. They get, like, list exactly what you're going to give them, like one full gallery of images mm -hmm. for them to use on their website, mm -hmm. social media. Um, mm -hmm. Authors, two photographers, two full galleries. Maybe say how many images you're going to give. Mm -hmm. Um, if you're providing tagging them. and stuff like that. Yeah, and, yes. and talk about how <laughs> if the shoot will be shared. I think we mentioned that we'll be like submitting it to publications, which they'll get yeah. um, mentioned in. The idea behind tagging is that we all tag each other in every time we share or post the images because we're trying to expand the reach of every vendor, mm -hmm. hence everyone collaborating on the styled shoot. So. Every time you uh, share on Insta, they've got to be tagged. You've got to you've got to speak about the vendors. If you put it online on a blog, uh, make sure you link to all the vendors, whether that's their website or their Instagram. Mm. You can ask which is preferred. Um, but it, that's how a styled shoot works. That's how you actually get it out is by each vendor throwing it out and linking to everybody else. Yeah. So creating a little a little community. Follow me. Hi, we do weddings. Hire us Any instead of Chris. No, but I'm doing one at the end of October, so I'll be asking you some questions. Look, Chris, I told you that. Chapter two. Chapter two.